Right. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Questions and Answers number 15, I think it is. Ah, uh, let's just get straight to the questions, shall we? Barbie Dins is asks, aspiring YouTuber here, what video making programs do you use? Uh, I stream with XSplit and I edit videos in Sony Vegas. That's about all I use. Backslick94 asks, Barack or Mitt? Well, I, let's just say that the right guy won. Although the question kind of reflects the sadness of the American political system, where you only have two candidates. Sure, there are third party candidates, but they're never gonna win a presidential election, so if you voted for like Gary Johnson or Jill Stein, you just wasted your vote, and uh, it's just kind of sad. Krafla asks, what is your relationship to other Swedish Let's Players? I don't really have one. I mean, I, I, I did a Let's Play with PewDiePie and that was fun back then, I guess. I've spoken to Robas a bit and he's kind of a nice guy, I suppose, but I don't really have a, a working relationship with anyone else or anything. DI Bandage asks, what started your passion to record and stream your gaming sessions to the public? Oh, what a fucking grandiose question. I was just bored one day. <laughs> oh, that's, that's about it. I saw someone else do it and was like, hmm, seems pretty fun. Maybe I should try it. And then I tried it and then I loved it and then I kept doing it. Rebson asks, how do you feel about the YouTube community? Uh, there kind of isn't one. I mean, the YouTube is such a large place, it's not like a community of people that share interests or ideas together, like other communities are. I mean, like, more like the YouTube user base, I would call it, rather than the community. Within YouTube, there are certain communities, though, like the Let's Play community and, like, the atheist and the Christian communities and shit like that. But YouTube as a whole isn't really a community. It's just filled with everyone, and that's why it's bad. It's like Facebook or Twitter, like, 99% of people there are just morons. But that's just because that's how people are in general. 99% of everyone is a fucking moron. Uh, and he also asked me, could you speak Spanish a little bit? I'm curious, not Mexican, by the way. I'm kind of curious why you asked, or why you added that you're not Mexican. And uh, no, I, I don't speak Spanish, like, uh, at all. I, I just do pretend Spanish, like, Ay, 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 Don Del Poncho! <laughs> and that's, that's about all the, the Spanish I can speak, yeah? Cry Angel the Brony asks, how much dicks would you suck for a million dollars? Oh look, a Brony asking a question about dicks. What a surprise. Um, a lot. I would suck a lot of dicks for one million dollars. Especially if it was tax free. Daggy Dag Masks 13 asks, are you a loner? Um, yeah, I suppose I am. Tech Coolster 900 asks, will you attempt to flay, 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 <clears throat> will you attempt to play Frog Fractions? Nah, sweet be done it, I watched the entire thing, it looks like a really good game, but the surprise is kind of spoiled if you've already seen a playthrough of it, so. We are Suda asks, will you be making more hilarious cooking videos? If you mean impro at cooking, then yes. I don't know why I haven't made any in a while. I, I'm, I I should do that. I kind of feel like it again, so I'll definitely do that. If you have any suggestions or ideas for impro, I, I know I have some on the on the back burner or whatever. But if you have any suggestions, just feel free to send me a YouTube PM. Uh, FP Exodus asks support or carry. Man, playing support is way too hard. I usually play carry. I think. Guy, uh, Moscar. What the fucking name? What happened to the idea of a Dope Lives community real life meet slash party? We, that was never serious. We were just fucking about. I don't think that'll ever happen. Maybe a few people from Dope Lives will meet each other someday, but we'll never have DopeCon. Even though it would be kind of awesome if you, you know, disregard all the spaghetti. And he also asks my opinion on Ragnunk, which is like a Swedish pancake thing. It's like a pancake batter without sugar in it. And then you add uh, shredded potatoes in it. Uh, it's actually really good, uh, especially with some ling lingonberry jam to it. I, I like it, or or like uh, apple jam or whatever. XX Bruna Lover XX asks, "Do you have any pets?" Yeah, I got a cat. 
he's old. Probably gonna die soon. Sniff. Maxxxe Killer asks, "Have you ever been in a real fight, and how badly did you lose?" Uh, no. Well, I mean, in in my childhood, I suppose I fought with people, you know, punched and kicked people, but that's not really a real fight, is it? That's just like, well, play fighting or whatever. And how badly did I lose? I honestly don't remember. Probably pretty badly. The Fifth Eye asks, "What is your favorite movie of all time?" Oh, uh, I hate this question, because it changes around so much. But I'm still gonna answer, like, the generic one that I've had as my quote-unquote favorite for quite a while now, and that's Cube Zero. It's actually a really shitty movie, but I just love it for whatever reason. I just love that fucking movie. Dwarian1 asks, what is your favorite game of all time? It's not one of these favorite questions. I'm just gonna answer The Curse, or it's actually not called The... Just Curse of Monkey Island. It's like the best game ever, not really, but it's my favorite, I suppose. Ryuzors asks, do you even play video games? Mm, not as much as I used to, but I still play them quite a lot. Bruce Wayne asks, if you were stranded on a desert island, what would you eat first? Oh, it's a, oh, it's a desert island. Oh, I get it. Funny jokes all around. Um... Chocolate, uh, like chocolate pudding, I guess. That's pretty fucking good. Or ice cream. Um, if they have pigeline, I would eat that, because that's like the best thing ever. <laughs> it's like a, a frozen, what is it called? Like the frozen ice cream thing that's sort of like water without... Uh, I don't remember what it's called, but like you have lemonade and you freeze it and it becomes one kind of ice cream. Eh. It's really good. Whatever the fuck it's called in English. Martino Hanna asks, have you seen seen? Have you seen Xavier Renegade Angel? If not, please watch like two minutes of whatever episode you can find. I hadn't seen it, I watched two minutes of it. It's kind of uh, it's kind of uh, XD so funny random humor. It's not really my kind of humor. Bastibus Name Taken asks, have you played Drakkar och Demoner? How does it stand as a pen and paper role-playing system? I have not played that. It's like a Swedish adaptation of Dungeons and Dragons, and I've not played it. Bruce Wayne asks, can you smell what the rock is cooking? Know your role and shut your mouth. The Snigsidilib <laughs> What the sh asks do you think your interests in video games will continue for years to come? Uh, yes, definitely. For Ryan Fable asks, do you ever tried to learn another language that isn't English or Swedish? Like Brazilian, Spanish, or even Japanese? Yeah, because Brazilian and Spanish, uh, well, yeah, because Brazilian is its own language these days. Uh, I did like four years of German in school and I don't remember any of it. It's like, yeah, yeah, das ist Vitamin, sehr gut! And like, yeah, I, I can't speak German whatsoever. I can sort of read it still though. And uh, I've kind of meddled in, in some Japanese. I know the, the, the alphabets or the syllabularies and shit now, so I'm kind of learning Japanese. It's just taking forever and I don't really have the motivation to do it. Ah, uh, Reduced to Ash asks, what's the one game everyone loves and has been trying to get you to play but you personally dislike? Deus Ex. I don't like that game. It, no. Also Thief. The Thief series. I don't like those either. Uh, what is that game everyone hates but and never plays but you personally enjoy? Hmm. I don't quite know. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, what is that game called? Oh, if I remember... Yeah, ooh, ooh. This, like, Nicopol... The Secrets of the... Nicopol, The Secrets of Immortal? I don't know, it's some fucked up point and click game that's really, really bad, but I just fucking love the shit out of that game. Uh, console games you want to check out if you got into console gaming? Uh, Uncharted, Little Big Planet, uh, Metal Gear Solid... Uh, well, I would like to get back into Smash Bros. and, and Mario Party, I suppose. Uh, the, the 3D, new 3D Mario games, Mario Galaxy and those games seem really good as well, so... I suppose that's a good answer. Also, um, 
I've been meaning to check out like Jack and Dexter or whatever. Jack and Daxter? 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 Whatever the fuck those games are called. And uh, Sly Cooper. Those games just look like they uh, are very enjoyable. They look like Banjo Kazooie almost or one of those games. Uh, XX Donaz XX asks, have you ever eaten Vegemite? I have not. And last question. Electromagnetic18 asks, what is your favorite sight, smell, taste, sound, and feeling? Jeez. Favorite sight? Probably like the, the, the glare of my computer screen. Smell? Um, like new baked uh, cookies, I guess. Taste? Oh, this one is hard. Um, I guess meat. Like meat and gravy, if that, if you combine that into one taste. Sound. Uh, geez. Some some catchy music, like some music that's that has a nice melody to it. And feeling, uh, uh, well, like orgasming, I guess. <laughs> Is that a feeling, or do you mean like feeling like love, or feeling angry, or sad, or happy? If it's that kind of feeling, uh, then I guess like. Being happy or, or glad is my favorite feeling. Oh dear. Anyway, enough rambling for now. Thanks for listening and or watching, guys. I'll see you next time.